Good morning. Welcome to school today. It is Friday, January 15th, 2021. Um, and it's our last day of school, obviously. And remember, we have a three-day weekend. There's no virtual work, no work on Monday, unless you're behind, and then you better catch up, because Tuesday, those folks who are B-Day come back, um, and those folks who are A-Day come back on Wednesday, okay? So uh, make sure that you're all caught up, because I don't want you to have to play catch-up when you're coming back. And our VLA kids, I want to make sure that you're caught up so that you can take Monday off, too, like everybody else, okay? So just, just staying caught up like we do when we're in school. Let's get our day started by standing for the pledge to the flag. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible with liberty and justice for all. All right, we finally have some birthdays to announce, <clears throat> but nobody today, actually just over the weekend kind of folks too. So. Um, let's see, over the weekend, Aiden Banks celebrates a birthday tomorrow, and so does Gia Chavez. Um, Ariana Anderson celebrates a birthday on Monday, and so does Matthew Barbashevich, and so does Bracey Smith. And then we got some folks who will celebrate a birthday on their very first day back to school um, in our, <coughs> excuse me, new world. All right, we've also got some, oh, the man of the week, remember, goodness. <coughs> excuse me, if you need to get someone's attention, the best way to do that is to say, excuse me. Okay, um, I already reminded you, make sure you're caught up with your eye ready and all of that kind of stuff. And um, those of you who come back to school on Tuesday, you don't bring your computers. Um, you just bring anything you took home on, on that last day. So if you took home your pencil box or if you took any of those things home in November, bring those back. Um, but I think some of your teachers even have told you different things, but you don't bring your computer back, okay? We don't do that till the following Monday when we start our ready testing, so. All right, so here are some folks who get shout outs from Miss Wilkerson's class, Cooper Aru and Connor Speck. They pay very close attention in reading class. Um, and Miss Wilkerson's also expects to learn. She, he was ready to learn in math class, um, Isaac Taylor. And also from Miss Wilkerson's class, Jonah Dean was ready to learn in math class too. Oksana and Miss Jones's class worked hard during interventions on hard work, and that was from Miss Smith. And Trip Howard in Miss Smith's class also, or not actually, it's from Miss Smith. Um, he finished his reading test. He worked so, so hard. So great job, you guys, on that. Okay, and I got a few more. Um, let's see here, some January jokes that, oh, this one actually came from Miss Wilkerson's class. What grades did the pirate get in school? High C's. I like that one because like in bigger grades you get A's and B's and C's and D's and so high C's. I sent that one to the high school because they will appreciate that one, I'm pretty sure. So, okay, um, let's see. Why or what did the snowman order at the fast food restaurant? He ordered an ice burger with chili sauce. <laughs> okay, this one's really for our girl teachers and maybe some of our, big, our fifth grade girls get it. Why are there only snowmen and not snow women? because only men would stand outside in the snow without a coat on. <laughs> I like that one. Which one is faster, hot or cold? Hot, because you can catch cold. And let's see, I did that one over yesterday. What kind of math do snowy owls like best? They like algebra. <laughs> okay, got all those, good deal. All right, say the Red Oak Rules with me. Respect ourselves, others, and our place. Expect to learn, do our best own our behavior, always treat others the way you want to be treated and know we can. It is so important to me that you keep your hands and feet to yourselves and that you are kind to everyone in your home, when you go out, at school, all that stuff. I want Red Oak folks to be known as, as very kind people. And as, just as a reminder, when we get back to school, we'll be silent in our hallways and silent in our bathrooms, so keep practicing that, okay? Have a great long weekend. It's always a good idea to just keep reading. Um, and then we will see our B-Day folks here um, in person, but we'll all still be doing the broadcast, um, so you'll still be getting that on some of those days too, okay? So we'll get that out to you as well. Have a great day. Love you guys. <laughs>